All right, guys. It's the next day. Um, I thought I recorded. Well, I, yeah, I thought I was recording when the hair was dry, but it was not. So I'm about to un uh take the bandana off. I use a scarf to lay down my leave out. And then I use just a satin bonnet to put the ends of the hair, uh, to protect the ends. Now this time, since it's in its natural state, I just, um, double strand twist the leave out. And then, um, in the morning, I just take them out. So I take the bandana off. Let's see what it's looking like under here. A mess. But, um, I changed it to a side part. <clears throat> it's not like a deep side part or nothing. It's just, you know, a regular side part. My track is right here, but it's enough hair to cover it. So that's good. So, I have my little clips that I hold my ends with. Because I twist it, and then I fold it up and put it. Yeah, so let's take those out. <coughs> so, that's the result that I get in the morning from the two, uh, the double strand twist. I'm just going to comb it out. <coughs> I'm not going anywhere, but I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like. Um, and I'm really liking the side part. I'm thinking I'm going to take my install down and do a side part. <coughs> but yeah, let's go ahead with the update. I've had this hair in for going on three weeks. It's about two weeks and four days. Um, this is the Genesis Virgin Hair, two bundles of 14 inch. Now, from the beginning, you can watch my other video if you want to see um, how I got the top to be this dark color. Okay, from the beginning, um, I've noticed that the 14 inch, I should have got, even with 14 inches, I should have got three bundles of 14 inch because, I mean, although it looks natural, it looks kind of thin to me. Um, in the back, and it could have been like I like. I should have um, sold some track just in the middle, so it wouldn't have that little flat effect right there. Um, so yeah, but other than that, the hair still soft. Um, I want to let y'all know about this smell. Um, it doesn't smell now, but I noticed um, in between the co-wash, um, because I co-washed it twice. So in between the co-wash, like, that little Frito smell would, it's very faint, like, but I can smell it. Um, so I'm looking around trying to figure out the smell, and then I'm like, oh, shoot, it's this hair. So I sniffed it, and sure enough, it was. So um, when I was washing it, uh, co-washing it Pre previously I could smell it when the hair was wet it was like a over powering smell almost so I let, I just put the conditioner on the hair I twist the hair like this get the conditioner on it and I pinned it up and kind of like tied it you know how you would do with your regular hair um if you put all the uh like a cholesterol treatment, you'll pull it back and put it in a bun. So that's basically what I did to seal in that that conditioner smell and moisture or whatever. So uh, it helped. Let's see. Yeah, it helped. Um, between co-washing, um, the hair does lose a lot of moisture, but it gets like a weird texture to it. Almost like, almost like it has a film over it. Like it gets really stiff and I don't know but yeah it, that's happening. but the hair is sorry that's my son but the hair is um pretty good hair I would recommend this hair it's pretty good hair now I only had it in for two weeks of course I'm going to do a full review um before I take it out which would be probably six weeks um but yeah, like this wave pattern is to die for. And like I told y'all before, I don't like 
all this part to be wavy because um my hair is straight like my hair stops all the way down here on the weave so my hair be straight right there unless I can really get it twisted in when I do the double strand twist you know what I'm but um yeah so <coughs> This is my little side part. I got to touch up my leave out a little bit because it's still like not as straight as I would like it to be. But yeah, so I mean, it's cute. Um, so let's see what else. Tangling. It doesn't really tangle. You'll get some snags in the back, but you can just finger comb those out. Shedding. I get like two strands a day and that's if I'm styling like right now I'm not gonna get any strands and I'm like pulling but y'all I did see my webs if you remember my Miss Perfect Hair video that hair was shedding like crazy and I sealed the webs with that so um yeah I had to seal the webs with this one I had to make sure so um I did seal the webs with this and I didn't cut them until I got to the top but uh, it's a very natural looking sew in to me. I think it looks natural. What y'all think? But um, yeah, so <clears throat> at night, what another thing I do, make sure I'm still recording. Another thing I do um, after I stop wearing the nat, uh, remember I told y'all I would let y'all know how I got that body waves pattern. All I do is bantu knot it at night. But I've seen a lot of people start the bantu knot down here. I start the bantu knot all the way up here. So I'll start to almost flat twist my hair. Yeah, my tracks will be showing. But I twist it here and then I just twist it downward. Gather and twist. Gather and twist. So this is what I would do. I twist it all the way down. It almost look like an Egyptian type style. Take it and just wrap it around. And you'll make it sure it's really, really tight. Then I take a ponytail holder and um wrap it around so it's holding then in the morning <clears throat> I take it out and this part up here is like feathered back into waves instead of it being straight and um wavy at the bottom yeah so that's how I do that um I'll have a tutorial on that um whenever I start whenever I get out of this natural wave pattern which is probably soon yeah so that's my two and a half week update on the Genesis Virgin hair. Um, I covered tangle and shedding, smell, um, that weird film. Yeah, those were pretty. Oh, the ends. I had to cut my ends um, because they were out of control. So I snipped the ends a little bit. I had to because they were like. I mean, yeah, they were really light at the bottom, but they were really jagged. So, I just cut the ends. You can kind of tell if I pull it together like this. Yeah, but I had to cut the ends because they were out of control. So, um, you know, the hair would be pretty, like when I wore it straight, it would be pretty and they're really jagged. So, I guess that's why a lot of people thought of my hair because it looked real jagged or whatever. But, um, yeah, so, I was thinking about just taking a little twist <coughs> like this and pulling it back of course I have to conceal my track or whatever but yeah I was just thinking of wearing it <coughs> like that for the week for class yeah so let me know what you think leave any comments or questions you have below and I'll be coming with more videos for you guys um I am going to be curling the hair or using the curl wand I don't know but um, I'll be sure to let you guys know. So I'll talk to you later. It's been real.